What's happening, SWE? It's Mr. News here, your SWE heavyweight champion. And I've been standing here admiring the event poster for Uprising. I like this poster. I fucking love this poster. Not just because my handsome face is slap bang in the middle, but because, well, there's somebody missing from this poster. Yeah, Braveheart. For the first time in God knows how long, Braveheart ain't on your event poster. And that, to me, symbolises a new era. A news era in the SWE. I ended this challenge. And by ending Braveheart's challenge, the title race has been blown wide open. Everybody's making their case for having a shot at Mr. News. I'm the one to catch. And the general manager, Alex Foulas, handpicks my opponent for this Saturday. All night, Ian Ambrose. This is the point in these videos where I'm supposed to poke fun at him and rip on him a little bit. But I'm not going to do that because as much as I don't like Ian Ambrose... I respect the hell out of Ian Ambrose. He's one half of the SWE Tag Team Champions. He's a guy who'd be arguably the best wrestler in Scotland right now, Mikey Whiplash, at Uprising last month. He deserves a shot at the SWE Heavyweight Championship. But it's just that, Ian Ambrose. It's a shot. You go on Facebook, you talk about how you're going to break my bones, kick my head in and take my belt. No. It's just a shot for you. This means everything to me right now. I will do whatever it takes. I will do whatever it takes to ensure that I am SWE's champion. So it's going to happen at Uprising. In front of, in front of all the fans of the SWE. You know those fans that once upon a time I would do anything to have them on my side. I would pander to them. Tried to get them to chant for Mr. News. Tried to please the crowd. Guys like the Gibsons, the Malones and, you know, maybe the Dundee Hurricanes. But the moment I stopped giving a damn about the fans is the moment that I started winning. And talking of the fans and talking of the Dundee Hurricanes, guys, if you want to come along to Uprising tomorrow night, please do me a favour. Don't hide behind the children in the back row. Take a front row seat tomorrow night. I'm going to give you all a lesson and what it means to win. Ambrose, welcome to the main event. See you at Uprising.